Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, I was heading in this direction. Uh, this is where the pirate loosely might be sitting. Uh, it's the approximate location, and I'm assuming this building is where he actually is. So I'll look into that in a second. But I was messing around with this stuff in the middle of the travel and we're at runaway mold now so i'm curious what this ends up being if i put it back in <laughs> nanite cluster okay all right so i need to process all of that to eventually run away mold for it to become nanite clusters okay so there was a point to it. It just took a long time. I can't complain. If that's all it took, I can't complain. And I eventually get 13 nanites out of this. Can't complain about that. Exosuit inventory. Refill this. And I might as well just put it on the freighter. Since that is apparently... A decent storage device in and of itself. I don't know if I want to put that there, though. Ask right now, put it here. There we go. That's fine. That is just fine. Now, now that I figured that out, that once we eventually get to runaway mold, then it becomes nanites. And quite a bit of them, as I should say. Now we can deal with the pirate, which I was correct in. They were here. Well, hello, Mr. Pirate Man. Engineering Entity. Ralnievo? Hey! <laughs> Lifeform Savior. Corvax was their slave. Corvax forced to operate pirate frequencies, but no more. Corvax hopes Lifeform believes their virtue. Gift of technology in exchange for silence. If Lifeform attempts to report Corvax to authorities, Corvax will take le le lethal countermeasures. Whoa. Okay, the life form offers up their advanced survival data. They claim to have been an innocent forced into a life of piracy against their will. The threat against my life does little to support their claim of innocence, but I have what I came for. I take the advanced survival blueprints and leave. There is nothing more for me here. Bye, I guess. Turn to the armorer again? Another Herald of the Ancients? But it's worse. Now it's missing three slots instead of <laughs> instead of two. No, I ain't, I ain't picking that up. No, the one I got is perfect, ish. Enough, it's perfect enough. It's the important part. Um, hmm. There we go. That's what I was looking to do. Whoop! Poo! Don't want to sell the projectile ammunition. I do want to sell all of the scaly meat though, which is what I was trying to aim for. All right. Good, 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 good. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's right. There was another door. Must always forget that. 44. Uh, I think I have a little too much extra. I ended up in spots I don't need. No. Uh, it's only... Huh. I thought I had more than that. Oh, well. Doesn't matter too much to me. Now let's get out of here. Helps if I'm pointing at the right thing when I press the button. Okay. Away I go. Wee. Time to get out of the atmosphere of Iguchi and onto my. Whoop. Onto my frigate. Wee. This is going to take a while. It's going to take a little bit longer than I expected. But it's fine. Whoa! Okay. Well, I'm in trouble if I'm stuck in the ship. I'm not good. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, boy. That was lucky. I was not paying attention to where it might have been. 
Oh, boy. But, now we're good. Return to the armor. Good. Now we're here. Whee! Now we head up here. Might as well use my jetpack for it, because it's easy now. At least easy for me to do that. And I hand it off to the armor. Let's talk to the scientist real quick. Traveler, you gather data as you explore, do you not? I find myself hungry for information, for details of the world beyond. My current research requires fine-grained mineral analysis. Would you be able to assist? Yes. Oh, hey! Perfect, Traveler. This will greatly aid my research. Please take these nanites as compensation. How much do I get? Eh, 50. Not terrible. Conscript. Conscript dog. It is done, then? Have you made them suffer? The armorer begins to cough. They do not appear to be in good health. I shall decrypt their data, interloper. May it bring you glory. But I... I have another task for you. It is almost the end. Whoa! Star shield battery and unstable plasma. Now I can make the unstable plasma. The battery is something new. I'm assuming it's for when my starship is in trouble. At least I'm assuming that. There is structure on this world. A depot of little consequence. But to the Sentinels, grah, they will defend it to their last drone. Attack it. Draw the ire of the Sentinels. Then our hunt can begin. While you are away, I shall create a powerful upgrade so that your weapon is fit for our great war. Conscript Dog appears to have declined even further. This longing for the hunt seems to be the only thing keeping them alive. The Viking asks that I destroy a depot so that the Sentinels will seek us out. They promise to work on some sort of weapon upgrade while I'm away. Go. I will prepare your weapon, interloper. You can. You can rely on my work. Well, hoping you can survive long enough to give me that work. Well, in that case, let's head over to there. Sentinel Depot. Alrighty. Get out of here. And... Oh, I didn't even get to see that ship. Oh. Oh, well. Perfect. And away I go. Whee! And... Po is on. Whoop. Ah, okay. I'm losing the Repains him. There we go. Heading to the depot. On a very hot planet. Do I have. I don't have. Crap. Well. Here's hoping I'm able to survive it. <laughs> oh, that's where the depot is, huh? Alright. Time to land. There we go. Like gentle butterfly. Okay. Away we go, over here. Break all of these open. Eat all their little dihydrogen goodies. And then I'll need to do this. Get some of the phosphorus. Ooh, sodium out of this one. Nice. Okay. And this is salt and sodium. Okay. Yeah, there are a lot of sentinels around here. Jesus. That's going to be a problem. My personal force field is going to be an issue unless I have this. Haha. -ha. Hmm. What the hell? 
was that? That was a thing, I guess. Okay. Well. I'm going to be pissing them off anyway. Might as well be shooting at them. Okay. Okay, well. At least the reload animation doesn't take all that long. Ow. Ooh, Magno Gold out of that one. That ain't too bad. Enriched Carbon. Take this. Oh boy, reinforcements. Lovely. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. Yeah. I had a feeling a lot of Sentinels would be coming for me. I was really hoping it would take longer than this. <laughs> Okay. I'm I'm gonna be hurting if I don't start moving. But I don't wanna pass these up at the same time. At least I get to not suffer damage while I'm doing this. It's a little bit of cheatsy doodle. But hey! Ow, 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 ow. Oh, oh spike. No, reload. Oh boy, some of these have armor plating. This is going to be a problem. This is going to be a problem. I'm, in, I'm hurting. I'm hurting. I'm in pain. I'm in so much pain. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Get out of here. Reload. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get in my ship. Ow. Okay. Well, circle around the planet for a little bit. That way they can't follow me. Out into space. Huh. Huh. Okay. All right. Okay. Now they're searching for me. Good. They're searching, but they're not going to find me. Because I am long gone. <laughs> All right. Stay on the planet for now. Just flying around. Out of their reach. Because then they'll have to search the planet. And... That will take a long time. Alrighty. Alright. Okay. That... Could have been worse. Could have been better, but could have been worse. Whoa. Hello. All right, let's put this where it ought to be, which is right here. Put this where it ought to be, which is the same area right here. Magno gold. That goes there. Uh, pugnium. Where would that go? Oh, right here. That works out beautifully. All right. Put the rusted metal in here. It should become ferrite dust. Yeah, not bad. I should probably lean upwards a little bit. Just so I, I can actually get out of the atmosphere. While I'm also focusing on moving stuff around. Got a lot of radon there. 130, that ain't too bad. Grantine. This also goes here. Yeah, this one's made from Herox, Dirty Bronze, and Lemium. Lemium. And this one's made from Aronium, Magna Gold, and Grantine. Okay. That's fine. Alright, and then the Phosphorus will move to here, where it belongs. Gek Relic. When did I pick up a Gek Relic? Not that it matters too much. Alrighty. Alright. Good. Now I can get out of the atmosphere. <laughs> and... Go back to my capital ship. Whee! My pulse engine needs a little bit more fueling. 
Alright. There we go. Yeah, it's recharged. Okay, well, that's not my capital ship. This is. But I need to grab a little bit more tritium first. But it's going to be wild shooting until I get enough to make me feel comfortable with my level of tritium. There we go. Alright. I'd say that's good enough. Break open these. Yeah. 2200, that ain't too bad. I'm okay with that. And then put the silver away. There we go. And... Exosuit. And refuel this. And... Oh! Didn't realize I had a gold nugget as well. <laughs> That's my bad. There we go. Man, I have a lot of gold. A lot of platinum, too. More platinum than I thought I would. Not that I'm complaining. Alright. Oh? Is there? Where, where would they be? It's a bounty of a thousand. A hundred thousand. Sure, why not? Why not? And once they're in range. Ha -ha. And away they go. Ow. Hurt myself. Cool. And we're golden. Get some chromatic metal. I'm at 800. Wow, my chromatic level. Chromatic metal level is lower than I thought. Words are hard. <laughs> Y'all know that. Words are hard. I'm sure most of you do. Ooh, I'm a savior now. Savior of the Corvax. Okay. Let's go park my ship. In my bigger ship. And it went exactly where I wanted it to. Oh, boy. <laughs> Didn't expect another ship to be coming out at the same time. <laughs> okay. There we are. Other ships in here? None other than mine? Yep. Cool. Whee! Yeah! Okay. Return to the armorer. Hope he's not just sitting at his terminal dead or something. That would suck. You. Conscript dog. Thank you. I have detected them. Their eyes upon us. You have done it, haven't you? Your actions have summoned them. I am sorry, interloper. I will not be able to assist you in your fight. I am too weak. Take this upgrade module and prepare for their arrival. A combat scope. Recoil stabilizing weapon scope for precise combat. I can do that. I can install that. No issue there. They approach. But before the final fight, I have another task for you. I need to be strong to serve you. There is a substance, an offering freely given by the young to their elders, that may yet restore me. I myself spent years enmeshed within the harvest circuits, my organs sacrificing their enzymes for the fleet. I was glad to do so. But we need not repeat such torment today. Enzyme remains found on Viking daggers should be enough to heal me now. Whatever sacrifice conscript Inandog in made for others, they do not appear to have reaped the same benefits in their old age. The Vikings' body is scarred, their speech labored, 
I cannot imagine they will survive another year. The armorer requires Viking daggers to prevent their further decline. The Viking appears relieved. They say nothing, but there is a look of hope behind their tired eyes. So all I need to do is find Viking daggers. Do I not have some? I do not. Crap. Well, that's a problem. Where would I get some? Is the question. Am I able to buy them? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it at all. That is a lot of rusted metal. And I can get ferrite dust for cheap with that. Haha. -ha. That was your fault, you doofus. Whoever sold them. Uh, oh, solar mirror too. I need that. Yes, you did. Okay. Do that. And now the multi-tool for optical drill is completed. Ha <laughs> ha. Beautiful. Now we're getting 50% more of the resources. Oh, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. All right, I'm going to move this to here. And then... Hmm. And maybe not yet. Combat scope. Do that part. That part I can easily do. But I won't focus on the ionizer for a while yet. In fact, you know what? Should I really even bother with the bolt caster? I'm using the pulse spitter and it's doing phenomenally. I shouldn't even bother, really. Pulse spitter is doing good enough. I'm happy with the pulse spitter. Especially if I get more stuff for it. I have no reason to complain if that's the case. So I'm just going to go all in on the pulse spitter. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm feeling today. Okay. Put that there. Where should I put these? I don't know. I guess I'll put them here. Because I will need them eventually. Actually. Could just craft more of these using them. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. We got it done. Beautiful. Are the frost? I guess they're done. At least they look it. They are done. Okay, there we go. And there's that done for. The farmer. Hireling Osu. There's quite a collection of life forms here, but very few of them are flora. I'm so pleased that this is changing. The farmer has made themselves at home in my base. Uh, overseer. Your overseer is very wise, friend. They arranged my contract, and they treat me most like kindly. Most kindly, you say. Well, uh... I did that, so now I can return. There we go. You have mastered the Frost Wart? Your base is already feeling more homely, yes? Yes. Does the way it shimmers in the light not enchant you, friend? I have lost hours to its gentle glisten. But now, a plant of great contrast. Solar Vine! Hey! And I have enough for it. Your next crop will be Solar Vine, a plant that grows deep within the mantle of scorched worlds. It seeks out all heat from the sun or the core below. Its roots can extend to such incredible lengths that it once was believed that they never ended. But do not worry, friend. Here, with our facilities, their growth shall be more manageable. It was, the text was so big, it wouldn't even fit in the box properly. <laughs> Hireling Osu wishes for me to cultivate Solar Vine. Yep. If only I shone as bright as a solar vine. I envy you the joy of discovery, friend. Well, I mean, yeah. 
it's kind of nice now, isn't it? Um, let's do solar fine. There we go. There we go. Perfect. So I'll need a lot of these too. That should be good. I'm pretty sure that should be good. Yeah, that should be good. Okay. Now I just have to wait for them to grow. Ah, waiting. Such fun. Uh, the collecting Viking daggers part is going to be difficult. From the Viking traders at outposts or find them in planetary containers. It's going to be annoying. Okay. Expanding the base. Acquire a circuit board. Do I not have a circuit board already done? Did I not do that? Well, I have the ability to make one. I just need the heat capacitor and the pop fiber. I need cactus flesh and star bulb. Well, I can at least do the heat capacitor. Uh oh. I ran out of... <laughs> ran out of power. To finish this out. Wow, I'm getting so much, so much ferrite dust out of this. This was one of my best ideas. <laughs> Whoops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to do this. There we go. Much better. Much better. Doing good. Doing fine. All right. And with that completed, I honestly think I should move this, but this is fine. Hmm. Nah, nah. Just do it the old-fashioned way. I shall just fly to the planets. And again, I'm thinking this system... Well, I have the blueprint. Does it need to be able to do polyfiber? And I need cactus, flesh, and star molds. That's fungal mold. Don't need that. That's a Gucci. Doesn't have that. It's phosphorus, selenium. Okay, is there any other planets in this system? Because I feel like these three that I'm able to see isn't all that's here. Oh yeah, the life incompatible planet. But then there's also this, which is the corrosive planet. But it also has just fungal mold. <sighs> okay. So where I'm at currently is a Corvax planet system. Rather, solar system, I should say. Um, that is Vikeen. Maracumo. Interesting. And it's mass production. Conflict is rowdy. About here. That's Gak. Oh, I need an indium drive for that. I need an emerald drive for that. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, man. Some of these, I just need a different drive altogether. Be able to make it. That is Viking. But none of the other stuff is filled out. Crap. Okay, let's head to Maracumo. So at least that's Viking. And I can hopefully, possibly, perhaps. Wait, what? Is that where my current fleet is? Is that what you're telling me? Power generation. I'm, I'm guessing that's where it's saying my fleet is. I guess. I don't know. I'm assuming. Alright, yeah, like I said, we're going to Maracuma. Away! 
I just don't know what planets are in Maricuma. I should say what kind of planets. I'm looking for them with star bulbs and cactus flesh. That is the question. This is unknown. Okay, well. Good place to start. Fungal mold. Damn it. Well, so much for that. Um, star bulbs! There we go. That's what I like to see. Let's head towards the landmass. Huh? So at least with the landmasses, I can possibly find a place to land on. I vanish major. Look around and fly around until I see star bulbs. Or at least something that would probably give me them. Well, that answered my question. Unknown building. I have a feeling I know what it is. It's not necessarily something I need to worry about. So let's land here. Like butterfly. Okay. Let us go. Whee! Get these star bulbs. Whoa, wait. There's something special over here. Oh, it's underground. Well, that's something I'll have to work on. Hey, hey, star bulbs. I'm okay with this. I'm going to have to grow these eventually, too, so I'm going to need to collect enough for that. I never scanned any of these plants. For minerals? Oh, jeez. Now I feel like a dumb... Which I should, because, I mean, these are easily done. Whoops. Didn't finish that yet. Get these creatures scanned. There we go. What the hell is that thing? Okay. Those are some weird things right there. Alright. Might as well grab all the star bulbs first, and then I should focus on scanning everything. Oh, wait. Haha. <laughs> See how much more I get out of that. Yeah, it doesn't seem like that much more. At least in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't seem like that much more. A whole bunch of Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I need these. I will always need these. There we go. Knowledge stone. Okay, I can go over there. Is there... There is a creature. What are you? You're a weird looking thing, aren't you? Alright. What we got here? Um, hmm. Paraffinium deposit over there. Well, that is a look. Man, these things are giant. What could they eat to get that giant? That's the question. Well, I guess there are sentinels here. They will not like me doing things that I do. So, you know, try to be careful with them and whatnot. Oh, that doesn't really matter. Okay. Great. 
great. That's what I like to hear. Incoming storm of superheated crap. Wait me. Okay. Whoops. I keep accidentally swapping off of the mining beam. The Viking word for glory, you say. Okay. Impulse beams. Okay. I should probably head to my ship. Oh, yep. <laughs> There's the storm. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Wow. 206 <laughs> degrees Fahrenheit. Ah. Superheated atmosphere improves jetpack efficiency. Well, shit. Might as well use that more. Because I'm stuck here. Oh. Alright. And since I cleared out all the star bulbs here. Oh. Get all that condensed carbon while I have the opportunity to. Because, you know, shooting at it from, you know, low orbit. Is this really low orbit? I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> it's close enough. Shooting at it from the sky is, you know, just as effective. Okay. I guess what I'm going to do is throw that here. But then also... Oh boy, my hyperdrive needs a refill. And I don't <laughs> pull to me yet. Joy. Okay. It's, I don't even have close to enough star bulbs, I don't think, to make the polyfiber. Nope, I need at least 78 more. There we go. I had to do quick math. I'm not good at quick math, usually. Um, hmm. I have to wait until the storm goes away. Oh, lightning. Hell yeah. Hells yeah. Give me more. Give me more. Come on, give me more. I'll ask for a little lightning. Give me lightning. Give me the thunder. Well, that's good that the storm's clearing. So I don't have to worry about it for too much longer. Rusted metal. That's fine. I'll take what's in it. Gek relic. Because of course it was. I keep hitting the wrong button. Uh, put that there. Because that's the only place I can put it at the moment. And we shall put this away. And... Get some more energy in here to finish up this rusted metal. And we're good. Fantastic. Okay. Well, hi there, buddy. There we go. That'll serve as a bit of a safe point should, you know, I need it or something. I keep hitting that button. I need to do the other one. Urgh. Hey. There we go. Got that sodium. Oh, it strikes me now that there's sentinels around here. If I grab this, it'll be a problem. Well, screw it. Honestly, I'm surprised that none of them are coming to be angry at me. And now I'm a little surprised that it won't let me pick up these albumin pearls. There we go. The plant was in the way. Unidentified plant. Which is just carbon and oxygen. This is primarily cobalt, I'm sure. Yep. What about this? Ooh, it has a secondary element of copper. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Very interesting. I can use 
this for money. And this for money. The scanning is money. If scanning is money, it's a good idea to keep scanning. Always. Okay. Well, I fixed it. They're no longer detected because it's no longer there. Alrighty. So now that I've cleared that out, put this away and put this in there. Good. Good, 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 good. Da 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 da. Let's get out of here and look for more star bulbs. Well, ask and ye shall receive. And blah, like butterfly, like very drunk butterfly, but like butterfly. <laughs> okay, break some of these open. Uh-oh. I pissed off the Sentinel drones. Ow! <laughs> they get hurt by... Oh, this thing. Bye. Uh, of course. Don't scan me! Go away and scan something else. Scan something else, please. I will fly. Oh, geez. Okay. Ow. Well, I should have expected that was going to happen. Ow. Again, should have expected that was going to happen. Please stop scanning me. Ow. Hurting me. Calling shenanigans. I'm gonna go over here. You can be curious about what I did. Well, not knowing I did it. I shall be breaking these open. For their wonderful condensed carbon. And another carbon. Because, you know, carbon's nice. Carbon's nice and usable. Oh, hello. Put that on that. Ow, oh, would you go away, please? Wait, Bay. Ow, you bastard. Fuck you. Alright. I was about to say, if he comes over here... While I'm collecting these. He gets pissy at me for collecting... Perfectly acceptable things to collect. I'm just going to be mad. I'm going to be very, very mad. Alright, and... I think... Oh, that... It's two left. Two left. And I think that will make the entirety of this area collected and finished. And that puts us at, if I hit the right button, A220. Nice. 220 ain't too bad. Now I just need to find cactus flesh. Need a lot less of that as opposed to what I got here. There we go. Wow, that was a lot of carbon. Wow. It's a lot more carbon than I ever thought would be coming out of these things. Not that I'm complaining. Um, maybe if I... Quick split this. To make this condensed? Yes, I can. Cool. I'm going to do that. Wait, where am I sitting on? 280. 280 now. Well, anytime I see 
plant that will give me that. Might as well go do it. The what? What are you? Y'all are interesting. I have no idea what you are. You like little freaking platypuses, but just bigger, eviler ish. Yeah, you, you notice it was... Oh, of course you notice I'm here. Because I'm standing on a rock. Because of course you notice someone standing on a rock. They're standing on a rock. A big old rock. And I keep hitting the wrong stupid button because I'm the stupid, stupid, stupid. Qualitary commentary there. <laughs> Qualitary commentary. And now these are mine. As far as I'm concerned. That drone can eat my booty. Inhale my... <laughs> wow, I'm going that old school with my memes. Okay, I'm in trouble. I am an old person now. Someone save me. <sighs> but no one came. But nobody came. Okay, ow. That hurt a little. All right. Star bulbs collected. As many of them as I really want, which, quite frankly, doing it this way seems to be a lot faster than collecting them the other way. It's hilarious to me. As I thought, the faster way was just collecting them from you know, those big towering plants. But no, it seems to be the fastest way is just mining them directly from these plants. At least it has been so far. Okay. Well, I think I'm done with that. Now it's time to move on to... Well, first I'm going to get this knowledge stone knocked out of the park. Oh... Well, I don't know what those are, but those are something that I want to grab before I end the episode. Cool. Might as well finish out this little area here. And I think... Whoop. ever scan that sodium rich plant? I guess I never did. Now I have. Edible seeds. You don't say. I'm not going to turn that down real quick. What would these be? Oh, these are just navigation data. I don't need that. I have too much of that as it is. There's no reason. No reason at all. Okay. Did I ever get that knowledge stone? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. I got distracted by the navigational data. Okay, I'll grab that and then I'll head out. That's what I'll do. That's what I will do. Alright, and... Perfect. For war, really? Hmm. Nothing found. You've got more rusted metal. That's fine. And... That had nothing found? Or did I just not finish it? I did not finish it. That's what happened. Okay. Oh, look at that. I'm sitting at a thousand star bulbs. Well, now I can't complain now, can I? There we go. Alright. We're good. We're good, and we're out of here. And it's the end of the episode. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos, and if you want to see more, click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the game playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. 
I've been the one the only stray cat playing games and trying to collect star bulbs so that way I can finish that circuit board for the base guy. And really the next thing I need to do is cactus flesh. That was the word. Cactus flesh. That was what I was looking for. But uh, finding that planet's going to be a little harder than I think. Probably. Yeah, it's going to be harder than I think. But it's worth a shot to continue trying. Because really the last things I need for the other guy, the armorer, and the farmer really just take time. So I might as well do the one that I can knock out of the park, which is finding the cactus flesh and getting the circuit board for the main dude. Main base dude. The overseer, that's the word. Man, words are hard, especially when you have a migraine. But we'll get all that done in the next episode. For you.